What is up everyone, Azariel here and welcome to the final ADS play uploading schedule for the year of 2015. It has been one crazy year for this channel, um, one crazy year for ADS play and I'm pretty sure a, a crazy year for a lot of you. You know, it, it's been kind of up and down, man. It's been a... Uh, one hell of a ride, man. And, you know, 2015, I think I've had some of my best and some of my worst times <laughs> this year. Um, it's just been a, a wild, hectic ride. So, with this being the final ADS play uploading schedule of this year, I'm going to take the time out to say, first off, thank you to all the new subscribers that have come. Thank you to those who have been subscribed to me since 2000, what, 2006, 2007? When I first started my YouTube channel and when I first started uploading videos, thank you to all those that have been sticking with me and been watching my videos consistently. Um, you know, even though I can admit that my schedules haven't always been, uh, <laughs> you know, what I wanted them to be at times due to unfortunate circumstances, but nevertheless, it's like you guys continue to watch my content and I really do appreciate that. Um, so that's one thing. Uh, secondly, I, I want to give a special thanks to all of the people that have been attending my fan interactive events like, like the Yu-Gi-Oh! 101 Fan Day events, any online um, fan day events, which I plan on doing more of in 2016. Uh, I, I appreciate you guys for joining those, and uh, I look forward to more of those in 2016, a lot more of those. Um, the many other things that I'm unfor unfortunately I'm going to have to save for another day because what I th the things I want to say in other videos I'm going to save not say I'm I'm not going to say it in this one because I'm going to save it for other videos I'm going to put it to you like that all right so with that being said man let's uh get into what I do in these videos and I and updating you in all the games that I will be playing uh, this year and, and give you just a little bit of a hint of what I plan on doing uh, in 2016 because there's a lot of like DLCs coming out for video games so I'm going to have to get my hands on some video games this uh, like within this week I need to return some video games and um, get my hands on some of them some other ones so with that being said man okay so we got Fallout 4, you guys know what I've been uploading a shit ton of Fallout 4 footage. You know, I have Sword Art Online footage as well. I just haven't, you know, uploaded it yet. And it's just a lot, a lot going on, man. A lot going on. Um, so, I I'm trying to get uh, all of that footage packaged up so I can upload it and get, you know, get it uh, up for view. Um... You know, and things like that. And, um... Yeah, man. So, Sword Art Online, Fallout 4. I haven't really had a chance to sit down with Black Ops 3 and do the multiplayer like I've been wanting to. I may do that later on this week, uh, if everything goes correctly. But, of course, I'm going to get to that at the end of, toward the end of the video because I don't want to hold up. Um, as far as the Yu-Gi-Oh! 101 footage uh, goes, all the card reviews and all of that, that's still coming up. I'm trying to save everything that um I'm trying to save up everything before I just upload it in one big bulk because I don't want to upload it like one batch of videos at a time because I, I just want to get rid of it uh, like all at once so that's what I'm planning on doing um f f please forgive the background noise this is something else that I'm gonna speak on later on <laughs> but um uh, uh but yeah, I'm, I'm trying to wait till I get everything Yu-Gi-Oh related and just upload it all at once because I've been working kind of hard on some stuff and I just want to give it to you all in one big bulk um, and then we can move on to the next phase of anything Yu-Gi-Oh related. Um, so that's pretty much the gist of everything. That's literally everything for this week. Fallout 4, Sword Art Online, finishing up those two games, um, jumping into... Um, the Black Ops 3 multiplayer like I've been wanting to do because that's been on the back burner for a while now and I had some friends of mine that have been wanting me to get on there and play with them but I just haven't had the time 
And another thing to mention, I forgot to mention this earlier. Some of you may notice that the campaign of Black Ops 3 was deleted on my channel. The reason why I did this was because I started to get some copyright notifications for some of the music in there. And for whatever reason, I just did not want to take the chance of end up getting another copyright strike knowing that I'm getting these, the, 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 the ones that, um, that were currently on my channel cleared up. So I didn't want to add any more to it, so I just deleted them. Like, I just got rid of them. Because I didn't upload the rest of the campaign footage anyway due to the the latest campaign video that I uploaded ended up getting blocked in several countries. And I didn't, you know, I, and, then for, and then I just deleted it because I didn't want to take that chance of getting another copyright strike. So Black Ops 3 campaign is just going from the channel because of that reason. Uh, fear of getting another copyright strike, and I did not want to deal with that. So that's gone. Um... But yeah, man, so just to update you guys on several different things, first of all, my internet situation. As you guys know, I've been trying to get money raised to help uh, out with this in it, with, with this situation with the uh, internet. You know, it's been off and on, off and on at times, off and on. It, it's, just, it's, just, it's like a seesaw thing. Um, Without having to hold up, up things too long, um, there was several issues that I was having with my internet service provider and um, you know several things that I don't, I don't want to get into getting into deep into it because you know it's, it's over and done with I don't even want to revisit that in my mind but it basically they made some mistakes on their end that was a uh, apparently there was some computer errors on their end that caused my bill to spike up higher than what it, what it was supposed to be and it was like basically the bills were getting generated faster each month it wasn't getting generated on the same day for example you know when you get your services on the day that your services get installed that's going to be your billing cycle so, so let's say if your services got installed on say like august 10th then on the 10th of every month you get a new bill you know what i mean like that's the way it would be set up so i was noticing that I was getting my bills like a week earlier every t every time to the point where I it was like between my folks you know like the, the internet the cable that's my responsibility because everybody have like the different bills that they pay and it was my responsibility and the thing is they were on my back so much because oh the, the cable would keep going out and things like that it was stressing me out to the point where I didn't really know what to do because I didn't I, I, like I couldn't think you know when you stress out you really can't think and I was dealing with that on the side so it didn't really hit me that you know the bills were coming faster like that until I actually uh, sat down I looked at the the bills and then I noticed like wait a minute this these, these are coming like a week to like you know a, a days earlier than what they were supposed to and they ended up building up past due amounts faster than what they were supposed to and my services would end up getting cut off and it was an incident where they actually had pushed a check through that I did not authorize somebody there decided they were going to push a check through um, with some information that I had uh, gave them um, in order for me to pay my bill and they took they, they kind of took that and somebody just ran off with it um, I, I'm assuming they find out that they found out who did it because they because I, I haven't received any notification from like my bank or anything like that stating that that has happened again so you know I'm glad that situation is over but I'm still in a position where I kind of need help because they kind of left me in a in a hole I've been talking to them and the best they were they would think best thing they were able to do was like give me credit on my next bill so to, to lower it but it's like I don't know like it's just a bunch of BS with my internet service provider they have good service they got good internet speed and things like that but this is just like one of those questionable things like do I need to switch <laughs> so yeah the fundraisers and things like that haven't been going as planned because quite frankly it's like I haven't given people a legitimate reason I feel like I haven't given people a legitimate reason why they should uh, like donate money to me and you know not only that but in the past I have at openly admitted that I have you know turn down donation offers from many people due to the fact that I felt like you watching my content was all you you know was basically enough you didn't have to do anything else besides that and um 
yeah man it was just one of those things where I just I wasn't into doing that at the time it wasn't until I ended up you know backed up into a corner which I am now and I actually need the help that I'm asking for it you know and it's only a one time thing once I get that taken care of then you know I'll be in a clear and I won't have this problem anymore so that's basically all I'm um, that's basically all I'm asking for is, is just help for this, this one time because I don't really don't know what else to do so that's still an issue and it looks like my internet may be caught off on New Year's so some of the things that I may have planned for New Year's like Eve and what have you may not even happen unless another miracle happens but I don't you know I kind of feel like my luck is running out with those so I'm just asking please uh, donate the link to the to the um to the crowdfunding page my um GoFundMe page is is uh in the video description so you guys can check that out if if GoFundMe isn't your preferred way to donate and you'd rather do it through PayPal I have my PayPal email down there so you guys can send me money through PayPal as well so it, it'll help it's all going towards the internet which helps me uh be able to upload uh, videos and as well as buy some of the games that you guys have been asking me to play that I can't really take the time out to play like that but if I'm you know you know if, if, if I'm getting that support then you know we can make some of these things happen so that's basically it so other than that you guys know I do year-end videos that I'm gonna be doing later on this week so you guys get ready for those as well as well as my looking back on 2015 and going into 2016 video um, like I do one of those videos every year so you guys look forward to that as well and um, that's pretty much it so thank you guys for watching uh, peace and I will see you guys later on this week for content I hope all you had a Merry Christmas and uh, I will see you guys in 2016 until then peace